Welcome back to Fox 8 News in the morning. The Malevs fled Kharkiv, Ukraine, after their home was leveled by Russian bombs. Uh, Kathy Tessie has opened up her Westlake home, and now they're living here in America with her. And they joined us this morning to tell us their story. First of all, welcome to America and welcome to Fox 8 News in the morning. Kathy, God bless you for what you're doing as well. And Roman's going to be the, uh, the translator this morning. And we're going to talk to Vladimir Bob and his wife, Sasha, and the two kids. Uh, could you introduce them to us? Uh, we have Emma uh, and then we have Platon. Okay, excellent. All right, first of all, let's, let's, let's talk about the situation when you left your homeland in, in, in Ukraine. How bad was the devastation? What did you see? Mm, there was a lot of destruction. Mm -hmm. Many people were fleeing the area. Mm -hmm. There was a big panic. Mm -hmm. We have some video we want to want to see right here. This is this is your father's home. We want to show right now, just showing the before and after uh, the devastation. Now this is after you, the video we're looking at right there, and and just um, I mean, did, did you take this? Who took this video? Do you know? Did you video yourself? I went there actually. This is this is this is actual, and this is before right here. This is the before video, which shows the devastation of the Russian bombing. Um, talk about how you got out, and and I know your wife left first. Скажіть, як ви виїхали звідти? Я знаю, що твоя дружина спочатку покинула Україну першу. А як ви виїхали з Харкова? It was very fast. Uh -huh. You know, we had to leave fast. Yeah, uh, Sasha, was it was it difficult leaving your husband behind at that particular point? Sasha, чи було важко залишити твого чоловіка там у країні? Звісно, так, бо ми одна родина і Yeah, because we are one family. It was kind of yeah. very and difficult. I, and I know it was difficult for you to, to see your, your your wife and kids leave as well. Right? Тобі було теж важко залишити дітей і дружину. Так, так. You, you guys finally made it to the United States. How did you end up here in Northeast Ohio? І потім ви вже оказалися в Америці. Як ви приїхали в Америку? Чому? І в Клівленд? Чому іменно? Спочатку ми мали знайомих у Тернополі. First of all, we had um, a common friends in Тернополь, Ukraine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. І коли я вже воз'єднався з сім'єю своєю в Німеччині. And then when I joined my family in Germany. Тоді почали за нас питати в Америці. Uh, people started looking for somebody who can sponsor our family in states. Yeah. And, and in steps, and in steps, Kathy. Yeah. My goodness gracious! Tell, tell us about why you made the decision to actually open up your home. My husband was half Ukrainian, and we had been watching the news about the invasion, and we were horrified, mm -hmm. and uh, wanted to do something to help. But at the time, my husband. He had a terminal disease, and so we, we couldn't uh, manage helping in any way like this at that time. Mm -hmm. But we talked about how cool it would be, uh -huh, and, uh, uh -huh. and then he did pass away last October. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How was it living uh, here in the States? How has the transition been so far? Uh, Thanks for great people like Roman and Kathy. Yeah. And, and many people in the States. Um, Some good shots of you at home and all that stuff. Uh, tell me, uh, Bob, what was the first thing you learned here in America? Bob, what was the first thing you learned here in America? The first thing I learned was Happy wife, happy life. <laughs> <laughs> happy wife, happy life. That's very, very interesting. Yeah, well, uh, talk about how has it been so far? The kids are in school. How, how has that transition been for them? Оцей перехідний, як ви зараз і як діти в вашій школі? Дуже добре. Ми дуже вражені. Нам дуже подобається. We like it so much. Uh -huh. uh, Sasha, how has it been for you? Як до тебе, Саша? Зараз. Мені дуже все подобається. Дякувати Богу. Like everything, Дякувати церкві. Дякувати uh -huh. Кеті. Uh -huh. Зараз я знаходжусь в повній безпеці і спокою. Yeah. I'm in, you know, I see uh, 
peaceful skies right now. You yeah. know, yeah. Uh, peaceful security, skies. security. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. When you when you watch TV and you see what's still going on in your homeland, what goes through your mind? How does that make you feel? When you watch the television, you see what's going on now in Ukraine. What in your understanding happens? Дуже страх і ми є багато фір. Перше це це страх. Фір і знову і воспоминання, як ми втікали. And as we remember when we were fleeing, you know, постійно торкає серце і it's it's touching our hearts so deeply. So we are crying. Ну і Сенсаша. Багато наших родичів там лишається, і ми не можемо цю ситуацію ніяк відпускати. There is a lot of relatives we have and still there? you know, yes. Yeah. The, so situation is still, you know, very tense for us. Do they do they want to leave or are they stuck or you know, they're just going to ride it out? What, what's, what's the thought виїхати, чи вони там не можуть виїхати yeah, звідти? Uh, some of them cannot leave. Cannot leave. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think in the final analysis that you see a Ukrainian victory? Чи ви думаєте, Україна все ж таки переможе? Є. Нема вибору тільки перемоги. There is no choice for Ukraine, but to win. They need to win. They need to win. Now, you had a little something special for your kids when they came home from school for the first day. Take a look at this video right now and tell me what's going on here. Подивіться на це відео. Що це було таке на цьому відео? Це була зустріч, перша зустріч Платона зі школи. Платон went to school first day. I met him after school. Ми вирішили зробити для нього такий чудовий подарунок. So we decided to do this great gift, uh, an Iron Man for him. Well, what, uh, kids, what, what, when you saw your dad come out like that, what, what, what did you think? Коли ви бачили вашого батька, що він таке зробив, що ви думали? Oh, that's just dad, huh? <laughs> so that's just what dad does. Yeah, yeah. You have a tremendous personality, man. Where does that come from? You, you seem to be very, very happy despite what you've been through. дуже такий весела людина, гарна персональність. Звідки вона така походить в тебе? Uh, I was born like this. Really? I. Hello, world. I am a bull. That's right. That's right. That's right. Happy that's right. wife. Happy wife. That's right. Come and, on. That, and that's the key. Now, now Kathy, um, talk about how this makes you feel to know that you're actually helping, and it's something that your husband wanted to do, and something you've done in the past. How does this make you feel? It's very fascinating, mm -hmm. uh, and it's been fun. Yeah. It's a lot more fun than I thought it would be okay. because they, they're a lot of fun. They're very okay. entertaining. Do you speak uh, Ukraine? No. Or Russian? No. So how do, talk, about, <laughs> talk about how you guys communicate at the house. Well, um, I, I learned a little bit of Ukrainian, but okay. mostly they're, they're, um, they're, they're learning English, okay. and uh, I know a little German, and Sasha knows a little German, okay. so we were using that as a surprise okay. common language. And then we also use Google Translate a lot. Do Google Translate, that, mm -hmm. that, God bless Google Translate yeah. for sure. Yeah. Now you, you want to talk real briefly about how other people can help and, and, and just a, a thankfulness that, uh, that you guys have. Yes, um, thank you so much for having us this morning. I just wanted to thank you uh, for yeah. all American people because war is still raging, you know, yeah. but yeah. with their help we were able to bring them to help other families, you know, we have a lot of people I can talk about, you know, but we sent like 24, 23 containers with food, yeah. supplies. We're still working hard yeah. to bring these families. Yeah. My family, uh, ourselves, we sponsored six families. Well, excellent, you excellent. Know? And then so, um, and we're happy to help. And thank you, Kathy yeah, and Kathy, other people. Thank you for yes. doing what you do. Yeah. You look, he was on the set b before we got started. And you look pretty comfortable up there. <laughs> I, th I think he's coming after my job. I'm <laughs> just saying. You don't show up to my Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 Maybe. Maybe. That's <laughs> I'm sorry. That's okay. That's okay. Bless you, man. God bless you guys. Yeah. Kathy, you as well. Thank you for what you do. And uh, Roman, God bless you for Thank translating. You. Beautiful family. Beautiful yeah. family. Yeah. With, wish you guys nothing but the best here in the United yeah. States yeah. of America. First of all, are you ever going back or are you going to stay here now? No. We want to stay here. Want to stay here? All right. All right. We'll see. Thank you very much. Appreciate you guys. All right. I want to let everyone know a GoFundMe has been set up for the family to help them set up their home and rebuild their lives here in Northeast Ohio. In case you're interested in helping, we have a link on our website, fox8.com. Once again, thank you so much for stopping by today, and good luck to you. Thank you. Mm -hmm.